Visible implant elastomer, or VIE tags, are colored internal tags for fish, reptiles, amphibians, and other animals that are externally visible. The tags come in a variety of different colors, many of which fluoresce under VI or ultraviolet light. To tag an animal with a VI tag, a researcher has to mix their chosen color of elastomer, which comes in a liquid form, with a curing agent. It can then be injected into an animal under clear or translucent tissue. Within hours, it cures into a solid tag that you can see with the naked eye. VIE tags can be used in capture mark reliefs or CMR studies to learn more about animal dispersion and movement and to better understand animal behavior. It can also help with population management. VIE tagging has allowed researchers to identify specific individuals in groups of animals where all of the animals look the same. For example, researchers were able to tag individual small spotted cat sharks in order to identify and observe their behaviors. They discovered that the sharks had a kind of personality in that they were repeating certain social behaviors like associating with one another and being near one another. VIE tags have also been used to study mobility, molting behavior, and how often shelters are used by European lobsters. VIE can be a useful tool to also study earthworms and their movement and dispersal. VIE tags are also a really helpful technology to use in the North Pacific giant octopus because they're highly intelligent species and they've been known to remove external tags. In one study, 1,730 North Pacific giant octopus were tagged and released, and 238 were recaptured. This tracking study provided information about the octopus population size and life history that other tagging methods could not provide. VIE tags have also been used on egg masses. Researchers have tagged salamander egg masses to identify and track those egg masses and monitor their development. VIE tags are great because of their versatility. They can be used on a variety of different animals and many animals like fish and frogs that might be too small to use other tagging methods on. Plus there are 10 different colors to choose from. So when mixed and matched, there are a lot of different color combinations that can mean different things for researchers. When injected properly, VIE tags should last an entire animal's lifetime. Unlike external tags, there's no worry about them falling off. They're also affordable and very easily identifiable on tagged animals. But there are a few things to consider before choosing VIE tags. Any tags placed under pigmented tissue can be kind of hard to spot, and several colors look very similar to each other, such as red and pink. Some colors are also harder to spot on certain species. If you're not an expert sampler, choosing very different colors, like red and blue, can really help with sampling. If an animal is handled vigorously after injection or placed immediately in water, the tag can fall out of the injection site. Any tagged specimen should be handled with care for 10 days after injection to make sure the wound site heals. In one study, zebrafish spent more time around other zebrafish that had been tagged with VIE tags than zebrafish that had not been tagged. So these tags might affect how different animals behave. This means that choosing neutral colored tags it will be important for future behavioral studies. VIE tags can be an incredibly useful tool to better understand population dynamics, animal movement, and also can be used to help protect species. The researchers should definitely consider some of the downsides to this technology before choosing to use these tags in their research. So now you know all about visible implant elastomer tags.